Andy Kaminsky wants the public to watch the footage and see what happened to her husband last year. She hopes it sparks change for detention officers in Guilford County. This video shows the moments before inmate Elijah Evans attacked officer Sheldon Kaminsky at the Guilford County Detention Center in July 2021. Evans knocked Kaminsky to the ground and beat on him for about five seconds. So many people said to me, how did the inmate get to him in the first place? Well, he was one officer locked in a pod with a dozen or more inmates while they were on their state mandated free time. And that's what goes on in that jail all the time. After the attack, Evans is seen walking away and eventually gets handcuffed. Kaminsky's wife said short staffing led to dangerous conditions. I really believe that if there had been two officers in that pod at that time, that there's a good chance that he would have been deterred from what he did. His wife said he continues to recover from a traumatic brain injury. Uh, there's been months where we have 16 appointments in one month. So it's, it's a lot of work recovering. Evans was sentenced to 10 and a half to 15 years in prison. His full sentence includes past crimes. But if you look at it specifically in the charge for Sheldon, he got the maximum for that charge, which was six to nine years. That's not very much considering that this will be with Sheldon the rest of his life. Kaminsky's wife hopes sentencing laws can get changed and more can be done to help protect officers working in prisons.